Well, Bob, the Seminoles are batting 500 in these first round tournament games. They've been here four times previous, winning two of those, including the time back in 1972 when they advanced all the way to the Final Four here in Los Angeles. But this time around, it looks like the first step may be the toughest for Florida State. The biggest difference in this game is playoff experience. The Hawkeyes have been down the NCAA road nine of the last ten years. Florida State, on the other hand, is making its first appearance in eight seasons. We've got to talk about being something special. We've got to talk about that this is our first, but sometimes the first is your most special. They've been here before, but we're new to it. Let's use that as a positive. The big secret behind Iowa's 22 victories this year is pressure. 40 minutes of in-your-face turnover basketball. George McLeod is the man who must steer the Seminole offense clear of the danger. It's going to be a team effort, the way we're going to try to beat this press. We're going to um, try to pass the ball over it, you know, not really dribble through it, but just get it up the court and work our half-court offense. The Iowa game plan is quickly revealed on the scoreboard. The Hawkeyes racked up more than 100 points in 13 games this season, averaging better than 91 per contest. It has both sides talking about controlling the tempo of the game. We got to force the tempo, make them play our style of basketball, and if we do that, I feel that we can be successful. They get most of their points off the press, and if we uh, control the tempo and control our turnovers, then we'll have a good shot. Sounds like stereo. Otherwise, the two clubs match up pretty well. Neither team has a height advantage, but rebounding will be a key. So will confidence. Our club knows that we can beat anybody in the country. We've got to play pretty close to the peak of our game to do that. We've got some inexperience and we've got some weaknesses too, but when we play well, we're a pretty good team. Right now, what's your gut feeling? My gut feeling is that it's going to be a heck of a game. Well, Bob, tip-off will go in, well, less than three hours now. The 12th seeded Seminoles hoping the 5th seeded Hawkeyes will be underestimating the tribe just a bit. We'll see. Reporting from Pauley Pavilion in Los Angeles, I'm Scott Atwell, Channel 6 Eyewitness Sports.